everybody. Uh, my name is Cindy Lou, and this Elaine is Hartley. Elaine Hartley, who you probably know. <laughs> <laughs> Elaine's back in LA because she is dedicated now to her essential oils, and um, we've known each other for how long? Oh, since 2009? Yeah. yeah. Long time. And um, I... As soon as I got these oils, uh, I brought them over to her house, like, you got to try these oils. <laughs> and she immediately got on board. So we've basically been doing this for the same amount of time. I think I first discovered them in 2013, and then went to aromatherapy school in 2014. And Elaine also just completed her, um, she makes great blends. She started with, like, chakra blends and all this stuff, and um, you just finished your personal trainer's certificate, yeah. Why not? <laughs> um, we've got a couple people here, but feel free to ask your questions. Somebody's manning the Facebook thing. Today, we are talking about how to detox and lose weight with essential oils and other stuff, supplements. Um, everything comes from doTERRA. It's a really simple 30-day cleanse, so we're going to go through it, right? Yeah. Okay, so... Let's start. So we, I, I am the co-founder of Malibu Essential Oils, and, um, you know, we're kick ass, right? <laughs> it's 032290. 032290. Oh, okay. So just so you can, you know, you're looking at me now, um, I actually was really, really sick when I met you, because mm -hmm. her dad is a healer. Carlos Sebastian. He had a really magical program then, and he helped me so much, but I had lived in a house with black mold for about seven years, and I didn't know it. It was actually in the air ducts. We found out when we sold the house, and I was so sick, and it was so toxic. So I started gaining weight, um, which happens because fat stores on your body uh, as a, a way to protect itself from toxicity. So I attempted various things to lose weight, I'm going to show you some pictures so you can understand day one. And let me know, um, Myra, if this can be seen in the shop. Here's me. Can you see that? Okay. So here's me in 2007-ish uh, on day one of P90X. I was, I was incredibly proud of myself. This was going to be a big deal, right? I was 149 pounds. And then I went through about 45 days, and I got this far, okay? So, uh, if it doesn't look very different, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> and my ass worked out so hard every single day. And so here's me on day 90, after 90 days of working out, and eating a uh, high-carb, low-fat diet, as they suggested, right? I lost three Evan pounds, which <laughs> made me very unhappy. Okay, so we're going to talk about something a little more effective for us. So right, what you're seeing right now, I'm about 130, 131 pounds. Um, and it's, it was way easier than that. And I kept my boobs, which is an exciting part about our program. Usually when I've got down to this weight, which I've been before, as my mom says, she fat, she thin, she fat, she thin. Um, when I've been at this weight before, I lose my boobs, lose my butt. So it's like choice between, you know, having curves or no curves, like look like a boy or look like a woman, you know. So this program, I got my curves, right? And I've got a little, little skinnier. Okay, so let's just tell you how this happens because I know you want to know. All right, so it's a really, we love doTERRA. doTERRA is great. We use their oils every day, right? What, what oils do you use every day? I use Digestin every day, and I make my own deodorant, so I'm always using it under okay. my armpits. Yeah. <laughs> and what do you use every day? Uh, Digestin also, and lately I've been putting cardamom as deodorant. Really? So, yeah, I like it. Ooh. Yeah, funky. Okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> that would be my first choice. Okay, but you know, oils are personal, and when we usually talk about essential oils, we're talking about the oils themselves. But oils are chemistry, they're not nutrition. So today we're gonna to talk about doTERRA's nutritional line that is their cleanse line. Um, I have done every cleanse 
no demand. You can you testify? Yeah, she's known me. I've yeah. done <laughs> the master cleanse. I've done HCG. I've done a rise and shine. You saw I tried P90X. Um, the list goes on and on. I'll do all juice. You know, I'll do all kinds of stuff. This is the easiest. I got to eat real food and um, and I felt amazing. The last time I did this program was in May. So just so you all know, Earl and I, and maybe you want to start it with us too, and maybe you want to start with, with us too, we're going to um, we're gonna start this around March 10th. We're all going to start day one together, and then we're going to go through every week and follow up with people, let, it, let everybody know how it's going for us, and tell, talk, tell stories about how it's working, right, and dial it in a little bit, give you a little extra instruction from week to week, because we'll be experiencing it. Right? I definitely want to do it. Yeah. Yes. I don't know what it is. I <laughs> yeah, I mean, and, and so if you have already have a doTERRA account, what you want to get is the Cleanse and Restore Kit. If you don't have a doTERRA account, you're in luck. Um, <laughs> we can help you do that. The only way you can get a doTERRA account is to know someone who has one, and now you know us. Myra's here, and there's some people who don't have accounts, so we'll get them probably started today. Okay? So... The first thing we want to talk about, now what I've done is, and you can download these pages, we're going to attach them to this, but the first thing I want to show you is this little pyramid, I don't even know if you can see this, this little health pyramid, okay, now do you see that? So on the bottom of this pyramid is, is eating right. Mm -hmm. um, that means a lot of things to a lot of people. I personally am enjoying eating primal and paleo. You do what? Uh, plant-based, plant first, then move into your proteins and then starches. Okay. Are you doing anything special? Um, I'm just trying not to eat as many carbs. Okay, great. So whatever yeah. eating right means to you, you know, bump it up a level. More mm -hmm. fruits and veggies, less processed food. If you're, if you listen to uh, L. Russ's Primal Blueprint, the new one about the FDA, it's so depressing. So um, mm -hmm. it, things that you <laughs> can get whole and then eat, that's just the safest way to go, right? So up above that is exercise. I'm a like Pilates, yoga, hiking type of thing, right? You do what? I do free weights, plyometrics, anything that you could pretty much do at home with body weight. It's okay, good. great. And circuit training and yoga, hot okay. yoga. Hot, hot yoga, okay. So rest and stress management, so important, right? We need to, um, so, and Essential oils are a great part of rest and stress management. We have deep sleep blends. If you have a little diffuser like this one, this one's super sexy. This one's all glass and wood. Um, that's a great way to turn on your parasympathetic nervous system so that your whole body can relax. And stress is not just a mental thing. It's not a thing that you, you know, go, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm a stressed out person. No, your body feels the stress and then your mind activates into that stressful, uh, it picks a subject right, of yeah. what to stress out about, <laughs> but it's your body stressing out because of the toxicity that's all around us, so that's really our main so subject today, is to reduce our toxic load, and um, we are experiencing about 500 times more toxicity than people 50, 60 years ago, mm -hmm. that's in some book by some guy named Dr. Reed, I believe, <laughs> um, but it, it is true, and the U.S. is particularly rampant um, because there's no regulations on a lot of things, especially the cosmetics that we put on our body. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah. And some of the most toxic things that you can have in your environment are actually indoors, right? So as much as we understand being in our cars and on the freeways, that's not great, but uh, unnatural synthetic room fresheners are one of the worst offenders, right? Mm -hmm. And then the paints, the worst thing you can do is have a plastic shower curtain and then turn on that hot water <laughs> and then heat up all that yeah, plastic stuff and then, and then breathe in what's off-gassing. Like, that's the absolute worst. But we do it. And there's no way to escape the toxicity around us. I mean, we live in a pretty pristine area. We live by a lake uh, near Malibu and up in the mountains. And we still experience toxicity every day. It's just, it's just what's happening, right? We understand that. So we use oils to reduce our toxic load. We use them in the diffusers. We use them as hand, like she's using it as a deodorant, mm -hmm. right? So she doesn't have to use that kind of weird product. Aluminum. <laughs> on her pants. Yeah. Things go in. Yeah. 
Um, <laughs> so that's one way we use oils, right? It's cleansers, as skin products, um, making our own things. That's one way that we can really reduce that, and we teach that stuff in other classes. Um, but today we're actually going to talk about how to use um, doTERRA's cleanse line and their supplements to get things out of your system and give yourself a reboot for 30 days and then after that you'll go into a slim and sassy program or we will um, where we can drop a few LBs right mm -hmm. I like to get skinny so I can eat again um, <laughs> give me a little vacation room right? yeah. okay so let's start with uh, so we're gonna go over this sheet and you can download this one this is the one with all the little cubes called the clean slate one and the first thing we have to do is start with our foundational mm -hmm. uh, nutrition, right? So oils are chemistry, they're not nutrition. They're the writers and the directors. And the nutrition, um, your vitamins, your minerals, that kind of thing, are the building blocks. So that's all the actors and, the, and the everybody else who's actually doing the work and putting the real things together, right? So they need that architecture, but they also need... The building blocks for things to actually happen. So, um, Elaine, do, I take this every day. Do you like the Lifelong Vitality Pack? I take a half dose of okay. it to stretch it out. Yeah. That's just what I do, but yeah. I love it. Great. Okay, so, so tell us a little. So there's three things in here, and you know, we used to have this giant cabinet of supplements, and <laughs> it was cabinets and, and then a couple drawers, right? So what this has done is this is a basically our daily dosage of stuff. Other than I gotta take like a thyroid thing and some hormone stuff um, because of the black mold situation made other things worse. So, but these three cover a lot of ground. So, what do you know about Alpha CRS? Alpha CRS uh, helps your body fight off free radicals. So that's little radical cells that are damaging to the rest of your cells. It has a bunch of antioxidants in it and polyphenols. Mm -hmm. right. Isn't that one good for, uh, is that the anti-inflammatory? I don't know, I just take them and I feel the difference. So, but I, she's the Turmeric one. in it is okay. anti-inflammatory. Yeah. And it also helps your brain too because it has ginkgo biloba in it. Okay, great. And can I tell you, like, these are all uh, naturally sourced and plant-based. So, they and they go hand in hand with the oils. So, if you're going to use doTERRA's oils, it's really great to use their supplements because they work together. In fact, mm -hmm. there are oils in this one, which is the Z, Z Omega. Yeah, Z Omega. So this has all of your crucial oils that you need, like your Omega 3s, your 6s, your 9s. I think that the regular one is derived from fish, and if you don't do fish, they do have a vegan version. Yeah, there's a vegan version. Yeah, and this has all the acids, all the amino acids that you need to supplement what you already incorporate into your diet. So this is kind of, we say that the Lifelong Vitality Pack kind of fills in the cracks that you haven't quite, quite done with your own diet. Yeah. And, you know, we all try to eat healthy, right? I, I know my chickens. And <laughs> we work at our farmer's market. Yeah. So we get all of our stuff from farmers that we know. I mean, I, I, I literally, you know, know what egg came from what bird. <laughs> Um, I visited farms in Central California with your dad, actually, yeah. uh, to make sure that those cows were being humanely raised. Like we're nerds about nutrition, and we still supplement mm -hmm. um, because it is like things just aren't what they used to be. They're not what the body yeah. needs to really thrive, right? And then the Microplex VMZ has all your what? The vitamins and minerals. So like your B vitamins, your A, C, E, your K. Everything that you need, just like as the base, your zinc, your magnesium, just everything that is literally in every single cell of your body, this one has it. Yeah. Microplex VMZ. So if you're confused, oh, can I go back to the Zeomega? This yeah. also has something great called astaxanthin in it, and mm -hmm. that really uh, helps Earl. He was, he, Earl, who's not here, God bless him, he's, <laughs> he's enjoying himself at the Snow <laughs> Summit right now. Um, feeling great, right? He is so fair, and you're a fair girl mm -hmm. too. Astaxanthin actually helps you from sunburn. Oh. You didn't know that? So, I mean, he literally would glow underwater, and he ruined every yes. single vacation we ever went on by getting so burned on the first oh, day, but then he would have to, like, wear a t-shirt 
in the ocean for like the rest of the time. So nerdy, um, but interesting. But now he paddles out there with Laird and everybody else with his shirt off, and and we kind of think it's as fast as Anthony because mm -hmm. he's not that you know he tries to wear sunscreen. Uh, but anyway, so that this little thing you're gonna take the whole 30 days, okay? This is broken up into 10 day sections. These little check mark boxes are gonna make it so easy for us this time, this is new. I'm really excited because that way I'm gonna know what to take every single day. Most cleanses are incredibly complicated. They impinge on your whole day. You gotta carry a bunch of stuff with you. You gotta put dingers in your in your phone, if you've ever done <laughs> other cleanses, you know, and like this one's 30 minutes before I eat, and this yeah. one's after the juice, and you know, and then I gotta drink a liter of water. I mean, it's crazy. <laughs> so at least these, this cleanse is doable. Mm -hmm. You know, you're not gonna have to stop your life, and people aren't gonna look at you like you're nuts because you can we pretty much leave most of it at home and yeah. just take it twice a day, right? So that's the first thing. So the next thing that we really need to include is Parazine. Oh, this is my favorite. So this has enzymes in it that help you break up proteins from meat, help you break up complex carbs, so any type of starches into simpler carbs. It also helps you break up fats, so it assists your gallbladder, which is super important. And it gives you, I think it's called, I believe it's a hydraulic acid. So it's a... It, Hyaluronic? Hyaluronic. There you yeah. go. Hyaluronic acid, which is already found in your stomach, but some people don't make enough, so this just kind of helps your body make a little bit more. It simulates that. But yeah. I take this all the time. If I've I eaten too one. much food, I take two of these. <laughs> yeah, we, we all like food here. Mm -hmm. um, we're foodies. <laughs> so it really helps if you can get a little support in your digestion. But this is part of the cleanse. This is going to help you move through some stuff that's stuck in yeah. your, you know, in your intestines, um, this is going to be a huge support for that. But yeah, we take this cleanse or no cleanse, and the lifelong vitality too, cleanse or no cleanse. We sort of take that one. So then another one. Now this is the cleanse, right? This is part of the cleanse. So the oil combo is called Zendocrine. Um, it comes in capsule form or in pure oil form. Have you smelled it? Mm -hmm, I love it. Yeah. You, oh yeah. This is also, so this one is particularly for the liver, but I call this the anger oil, mm. right? So it, there's, um, your liver emotionally stores contentment or anger and rage, right? And it actually, those two are very bad roommates. So it's either <laughs> one or the other, right? And so if you're feeling a lot of rage and anger, which a lot of us are right mm -hmm. now, Zendocrine's a great oil to help flush that out of the liver and make room for contentment. So by the end of these 30 days, you're actually going to feel a little healthier because we'll also be dealing with the gut, which is a big part of the mood, right? So what's in Zendocrine oil, Elaine? Zendocrine has geranium in it, cilantro, juniper berry, tangerine, and rosemary. And all of these oils, they're either antimicrobial, antiviral, antibacterial, antifungal. They support more organs than just your liver. Your liver is the first thing that everything passes through, especially when you're eating, when you're taking essential oil. So it kind of gets most of it, but then it sends what it doesn't need to the rest of your vital organs. So it supports your gallbladder, your bladder, your kidneys, your pancreas, which is very important for processing sugar and it's all over support. But your liver does most of the heavy hauling in your body, yeah. and it's also the most abused. <laughs> it is, and so the first thing we have to do with any detox is love on our liver, mm -hmm. right? I mean, we really, I, if, and if, would you indulge me and just like put your hands on your liver and give it a little hug, like you have been beating this guy up for a while. So, and I always say, like, smile to the liver, you know, like, be like, thanks, <laughs> you're doing, there, it's doing such a big job, more than any other culture or time in the history of the world, this liver is taking a beating, right? So the first thing we do in a cleanse process, which is why I'm not starting with weight loss, um, as much as people go like, get into the weight loss part, right? Mm -hmm. We have to start with servicing the liver. And you will, you actually will. And people's, a lot of people's livers are inflamed. I've actually had this part of my body be distended because mm. my liver was so inflamed, wow. right? So you can lose weight just off your liver. There's a lot of fat in there, there's a lot of toxicity in there, and there's a lot of inflammation that can go down. Mm. 
So it's really important not to start the heavy duty part of the cleanse without first saying, hey liver, I love you, let's, let's overhaul you first, get you nice and strong, get you nice and healthy, and then ask you to do a lot more heavy lifting, right? So I actually take Zendocrine pretty regularly also because of the cilantro, which mm -hmm. is great for heavy metal detox. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. My blood tests came back with a lot of heavy metals. I don't want to do a big deal um, kind of heavy metal detox because that can be really difficult. Mm -hmm. So I try to keep up with it using things like clays and, and the uh, xenocrine mm -hmm. and, and pure cilantro, frankly. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, good. All right, I made her study up what everyone was <laughs> in everything. I was totally shocked that geranium was, because um, we love geranium for a lot of things. It's in our sex mix, which she discovered. Yeah. Um, and she's like, did you know? And I was like, oh. Uh, <laughs> um, so, you know, all of these, when they get together in a group, like suddenly geranium is doing something completely different because mm -hmm. it's in an internal form and it's paired with other things that are specifically for the liver, mm -hmm. so they'll team up and go and do that job. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, great. So along with Zendocrine oil, right, it's a little confusing, but you want to take them both <coughs> together, is the Zendocrine herbal formula. So this is kind of a line within a line, right? Mm -hmm. um, Zendocrine herbs, frankly, they just help you poo. Yeah. 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 Soluble fiber. <laughs> it has also marshmallow root, which is soothing for the digestive tract. So you have things in here that are going to help kind of move things around in there because you, you'd be amazed of how much you're actually storing in your gut, and that's yeah. where most of your weight is. Mm -hmm. I mean, there's like, yeah, I don't know, 30 feet inside of you where your food passes through. And this is kind of like the scrubbers that moves everything through. Now, this must have, it has milk thistle and mm -hmm. things that are particularly for supporting the liver. Yeah. Also, the other, one of the other um, exit pathways, you know, for detoxing is the kidney and the urinary tract, so it supports that. Yeah. And then, you know, a lot of people get um, skin eruptions and they're like, oh, you know, treat my skin, but in fact, the skin is a secondary pathway for releasing toxicity. Mm -hmm. So to do the cleanse, sometimes your skin just clears up because it's taking on the extra burden that the liver can't get through. Mm -hmm. um, the other pathway is the lungs. So if you're having respiratory issues, the lungs is another place where you just have to, um, you know, do a detox and you can, it, it, you'll breathe better too, right? There's stuff in there that supports upper respiratory tract. Yeah, so respiratory and liver and uh, kidneys and all of that stuff, it helps to push the actual physical mm -hmm. matter through. So, you know, I say some, some things are pulling, like let's say it's pulling things out of the house, the trash out of the house and putting it on the street, and then something has to come through, uh, you know, and take it off the street and move yeah. it <laughs> out, right? into some other place. Otherwise, it's going to back up back into the house. Okay, so then the last thing that you want to take in your first 10 days is lemon oil. Mm -hmm. Why? Lemon oil supports the liver and it helps just eliminate extra toxins that may be building up. And it's also digestive support as well. Yeah, and um, it's, it's really a great way to flush Again, it's one of those trucks that's going to take stuff out of the liquids of the body and help you pass them through. It's also a nice little deep bloater, I have found. If I drink lemon yeah. water, then that can help with bloat. Grapefruit's also amazing for that. Um, we're not talking mm -hmm. about grapefruit today, but it's a really good deep bloater. But this particular lemon, so this, if you haven't heard of doTERRA, doTERRA is therapeutic grade, mm -hmm. which means they're safe to take internally, right? Yeah. So you can't just go running around grabbing any old lemon no. from Whole Foods or whatever and start drinking it as ill-advised. Don't do it. Um, yeah. And because it might be fine. It might not. It's not regulated. So we're really dependent on um, watchdogging every company and checking their integrity because you can't count on labeling and that kind of thing um, at all. All right. So that's actually, so your first 10 days, right? is going to be, you're going to be taking your supplements twice a day, the, the lifelong vitality. You'll take a terrorism. I like to take it with my food. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, so like as if my food has like extra little workhorses in there that are getting it done, right? And then you take the Zendocrine. I like to take this one at night before I go to bed or after my last meal mm -hmm. um, because then give my body a chance to digest what it's had and then just take out on anything that's unnecessary. Mm -hmm. And then the Zendocrine, um, when do you, uh, well, she hasn't done the cleanse yet. She's going to be doing it uh, for her first time This w w with all y'all. Yeah. Um, the Zendocrine, I like to take this kind of first thing in the morning uh, mm -hmm. before I even have a meal because I want to give it a chance to just go straight to the liver and help it. I even... I really like to take this oil and do like two drops and rub it on topically so it goes right there. You know, it finds the heart of the matter. And, and the liver is close enough you can sort of get it yeah. to it. Do I need to rub a carrier oil first? Yeah, a carrier oil would help it penetrate into the liver. And you know your liver's on the right hand side underneath that those first two mm -hmm. ribs yeah. there, right? Yeah. So you can get it. Sometimes I do the back too. It stretches all the way across. Yeah, it goes around mm -hmm. here. So it's a great, it's another great way to get it in. You know. And when you ingest it, it's just like a couple of drops. You can do about two or three drops mm -hmm. in water. I like to think oh, of, yeah. and we'll go, we'll think about this it, when we do the slim and sassy part, the weight loss loss part as well. Um, but think of Zendocrine as the shot, and lemon as the beer, the chaser, right? So this you only need to put this in two mm -hmm. or three ounces of water and just drink it, mm -hmm. right? And this you want to put. In your water bottle, in my water bottle, only glass, only glass or stainless steel, or stainless steel, just not plastic, because this, no plastic. the job of this is to dissolve petrochemicals inside your body and outside your body. It melts plastic, right? Which mm -hmm. is really magical about it. But if you put it in your plastic bottle and then you drink it, now you're drinking plastic. Yeah, yeah. melts right. plastic. Which is exactly what we're trying to get rid of. Yeah. <laughs> um. So don't do it. Don't do it. Okay, so that's the first 10 days, all right? Mm -hmm. So if you think about it, it's really only about three or four minutes of your day. You can do, a, a, you know, take your supplements twice a day. These supplements, what's great about these supplements too is they're so nutritionally complete and they're so accessible to the body, um, you don't feel that hungry. So you're naturally going to eat less. And it's better when you're cleansing to just eat less. You know, yeah. just give your body a break. Let it eat what's inside of you. There's <laughs> All of us have pounds and pounds of extra food, undigested food in our body. You know, didn't they say, like, John Wayne had, like, 17 pounds oh of stuff in his intestines? Um, but, <laughs> you know, but we all do. We all yeah. do. And, and, and I... I I'm now, actually this year I'm going to be 47 years old, right? Mm -hmm. And a lot of women my age, they get this sort of rotund business just in the middle, and their legs are skinny, and their arms are skinny, and they go, oh, it's aging. You know, no, it's built up toxicity, um, and this is where we store it, right? And it's stress, cortisol, this is where we store it. So it is possible as you get older, and you saw my other pictures, right? It was all rubbly blubbly around the middle, right? So that's where we hold it, and it doesn't have to be that way. So don't give up on yourself. We're we're gonna be fabulous into our way into you know like 47 is the new 32. Come on. Yeah. Um, okay, so the next 10 days, you're still gonna take your lifelong vitality, like I said, and then now we're gonna move from the liver to the digestive system. So we're gonna start stop taking the Zendocrine. Right? Mm -hmm. Now the liver's happy. It's like, okay, I'll work for you. You've helped me out, right? Now we're going to move to GX Assist. Yeah, GX Assist. So this is for your gastrointestinal tract. So your small intestine, your large intestine, your colon. And this has oregano in it, which is antifungal, antimicrobial. It also has lemongrass, which is antibacterial and can be soothing for the digestive tract. So as we're going in and taking out all the bad bacteria that may have overgrown or been feeding on who knows what. We're leveling the playing field, but still soothing it at the same time. It also has peppermint in it, caprylic acid, which is used for, it's a big antimicrobial acid. It's found in breast milk, and this one's derived from coconut. And it helps fight off E. coli, salmonella, and strep. Yeah, sure. That's what I read today. Mm -hmm. But this also has melaleuca in it, lemon, and thyme, which are all antiviral and antibacterial. So it really helps kind of boost your immune system as you're flushing through all this stuff. You're 
things are going to come out. Things are going to come out in Woodworks. Like, no, you're coming for me. Yeah. <laughs> so this is the coming for you, but saving you at the same yeah. time. It's a killer. <laughs> right? <laughs> this is a killer. So it's going to kill a bunch of stuff in your GI tract. And um, we need that. I mean, yeah. there's a lot of weird stuff out there. And I have alternately used this. And it's actually a decent pain pill. <laughs> and I have also used this at, alternately um, if I feel like I'm getting sick mm -hmm. because of the oregano and the melaleuca mm -hmm. and the thyme and the lemongrass. These are all very antiviral, anti, you know, whatever, anti, anti. They're, it's kill it's a, This is a killer bomb, mm -hmm. um, which is why we wanted to service the liver first because once we yeah. kill this stuff off, we got to get it out of the system, mm -hmm. right? And now the the why I say like this cleanse is actually going to also improve your mood is mm -hmm. that your your gut is your second brain there there I just recently watched this thing that said that there was as many I think it was on Netflix about your gut watch mm -hmm. the whole thing that's really important um <laughs> what's the name of it oh I don't know it's on Netflix it's like gut brain brain gut I don't know but <laughs> it um it's actually they said it has as much um neurotransmitters as a dog or a cat so wow. it has a great deal of intelligence and you you need to like follow your gut right mm -hmm. but if you have a lot of parasites here's there's now you know more sort of random references but there's this great <laughs> TED talks um I spend a lot of time watching things and not mm -hmm. looking at the titles but there's a great TED Talks about parasites. And if you put in TED Talks parasites, it'll come up. Mm -hmm. It's like 20 minutes long. Um, but it, it said that there are the parasites in a person's body or an animal's body can actually make them change their instinctive behavior, mm -hmm. right? And so they can live. There's this one parasite that lives in uh, rats, but it can only procreate inside the digestive system of cats. Mm -hmm. So at the moment at which that that parasite is ready to procreate, it'll make the rat run right to a cat and get eaten. Mm -hmm. Is yeah. that the creepiest thing you've ever oh heard? God. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and <laughs> parasites also hatch during the full moon. Uh-huh. Right? So a really great way to kind of time this, and maybe I'll time this, um, with the full moon. We'll time this with the full moon. So I'll give you an exact start date when we're all going to start. But what you want to do is have the GX assist five days before and five days after the full moon for your sort of 10-day cycle. We want to mm -hmm. stick the full moon right in the center so we can catch those parasites while they're hatching, yeah. right? Kill the mamas, kill the babies too, <laughs> right? So, um, violent <laughs> parasite death. Okay. Uh, but that's okay. They they gotta go. They you know what I mean. You you don't have to go home, but you can't stay here. Is yeah. what this is. But if you kill them once, do they come back again? You know, I would suggest if you think you actually have a, a parasite bacterial overgrowth in your gut, I would do the GX assist part once a month for four months around the full moon. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I would keep this up, yeah. right? If that's what you think you have going on with you, mm -hmm. this would be a great way to really die off that. But they're persistent, and that's why we want to time it with the full moon. You know what I mean? Because in that way, you can catch them while they're hatching, mm -hmm. and then they have less chance of surviving at that point. So gross, but totally need to do it, right? And, sure. and very important part of the mm -hmm. cleanse. Disgusted mm -hmm. by this whole rat. <laughs> Oh my god, it is so crazy. And you know, this is why people, I think, if you put the two and two together, people behave more erratically around the full moon, and then yeah. they like regret it, you know? So it's maybe not them. But the hatchery. Yeah. <laughs> and also, if you have a lot of sugar cravings, if mm -hmm. you get voraciously, like, need to shove sugar in your mouth, you probably have some kind of parasitic growth, uh, overgrowth going on. Yeah. We need some parasites in our system. Mm -hmm. We need uh, some bacteria, you know what I mean? Yeah. But it's when it gets out of balance that they start to take over. Mm -hmm. So if you just can't go on without that muffin, right, you might be looking at <laughs> some kind of parasitic growth. You know, you're not just a sugar addict. You're feeding a different beast. Yeah. Gross. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> this is why we cleanse. <laughs> oh. All right. <laughs> so, um, so that's what we do.
for the second date, and then we keep taking the Zendocrine um, move alonger. Mm -hmm. Move along, right? So we swapped out the Zendocrine oil for the GX Assist. That's all we did for the second 10 days. So mm -hmm. it's your same three, four, we, five we minutes We keep today. taking the Zendocrine during the second yep. reset time? The yep. complex. The Zendocrine complex. Actually, you take it the whole time. You see the things you do the whole time is the Terrazyme, the enzymes, mm -hmm. the, uh, the lifelong vitality, so you have your nutrition, mm -hmm. and then the lemon. Because oh, we just got to keep flushing. Okay, yeah, yeah, so yeah. the lemon is flushing the liquids of the body, and this is flushing the solids of the body. So mm -hmm. we're going to keep that up Yeah. for the whole 30 days. All we did was switch the liver cleanse for the gut cleanse, mm -hmm. right? And then the third thing, the third part of it we're going to do is now we're going to renew ourselves. Because mm -hmm. now you've been through a lot. There's been murder and mayhem. Right. <laughs> so um, now we're going to go to Pebiasis. So this is your probiotics. So this is reestablishing the healthy bacteria, the balanced bacteria that you want. And it's double encapsulated. So you have one that enters into the stomach and gives you probiotics there. And then the second little, it's green when you get this, you'll see. It's a second encapsule, capsule that goes into the small intestine. So you get more probiotics where you need them. Because most of the time, you know, you're like, oh, I eat yogurt, so I get my probiotics. Or, oh, I eat kraut. Your stomach's killing off most of that with all the stomach. I'll show them. I'll open this one. This yeah. is mine. This one's mine. It's new, but I'm going to use it. Yeah. So, um... These are really cool. Now, uh, there's a lot of, this has um, six billion, mm. right? Six billion. What? Six billion um, little bacteria. You know, like, yeah. they, they count probiotics in billions. Yeah. And I actually have, so here, here's what it looks like. It's oh, cool. kind of groovy, right? So here, take it, check it out. So, and you can take that one if you want. Okay. Um, so, the, the, the reason why it's wrapped in prebiotics is you're basically... Probiotics live on prebiotics. Mm -hmm. So you're basically sending the probiotics in with full picnic basket, and that picnic basket is also protecting it so that it goes lower into the intestines where it's needed. So it's really great that they're coded that way. Definitely eat your yogurt, eat your krauts, yeah. eat your, you know, drink your kombucha, um, as many different strains of probiotic as you can have, yeah. the better, right? But we just need these to travel really far into the digestive system mm -hmm. because of all that killing yeah. that we just did, right? So we need to put the good guys back, back in force. And they don't live long. So you, so, so this one we're going to take every day. And really, you, you take your probiotics every day. Yeah. If you want to feel better, take your probiotics every day. They're an incredible, like I said, because of that um, uh, mood-boosting effect. Mm -hmm. Right? Definitely. The more good guys you have versus bad guys, the more... And it boosts your immune system, yeah. too. Having a healthy gut mm -hmm. flora, bacteria, and having that balance in there. Yeah. It's important. Okay, so along with that, right, what we add to the program, which I don't have here, but is actually... And Melanie Bell, if you are watching, this is Melanie Bell's favorite thing in the yeah. whole world. Uh, DDR Prime. DDR Prime. So we're going to renew ourselves with DDR Prime. So tell us about DDR Prime. DDR Prime is the, is it DNA repair? Yes. Yeah. Cellular so it's, it DNA. It has clove in it, frankincense, summer savory, lemongrass, uh, wild orange. Yeah. And it's Hi. Susan, you have Uh. Did you see her? I have not seen her keys. Is she look looking for them? Yeah, I'm yeah. gonna look here and outside. I just wanted to. Absolutely. I don't want to interrupt if you see no, you're fine. Yeah. Say hi. hi. We're on Facebook Live. Hello. <laughs> <Yeah>. Matthew <laughs> Chico Master. Chico okay, Master. so <laughs> looking for keys like a good husband. <laughs> um, for key. <laughs> That's yeah. her car key. To unlock all the answers in life. Okay. Yeah, okay. okay. Um, we're actually in Susan Valdez Cohen's office. Mm -hmm. She's at Malibu Aesthetics, right? So we do some consults here. That's the bathroom. That's not it for sure. Um, <laughs> and so we teach classes here, and that was her husband, who is an awesome Qigong and Tai Chi teacher. So, anyway, it's all family here. 
Um, okay, so DDR prime, back to DDR prime. That's your DNA and cellular repair. So as you go through your life, you're constantly getting damaged in some way. You break a bone, you get a scar somewhere. Your cells are, they need to keep re making themselves from each other and what this does is it goes into the cells that are already there living keeping you alive and it helps repair any damage that they may have so that way when they go to replicate again they're replicating healthy cells yeah does so also, great for apoptosis yeah sorry does it random question but does it help also with like emotional damage you know, every single one of these oils has an emotional property, right? I like to think about essential oils as working in a column. There's the physical body, there's the emotional body, and then there's the spiritual body. So what it does for you on one level, it's going to do a similar thing on the other level. So if you're talking about um, what, what D DDR Prime is great for is um, apoptosis, mm -hmm. basically selective cell death, right? So instead of letting cells mutate when their DNA is off and continue to replicate themselves, it kind of looks at it sideways and says, uh, I don't like the looks of you. You don't match up mm -hmm. with, you know, what's going on here. So we're going to go ahead and kill you off, right? Mm -hmm. So if you think about, we have thoughts mm -hmm. that are like that too. Mm -hmm. You know, they really just don't belong to us or they're just not part of who we truly are at our core. Mm -hmm. And yeah, it can absolutely kind of adjust those thoughts too as well, I believe, right? Mm -hmm. So these these oils work in, in a lot of different dimensions. Today we're definitely talking about the physical. Mm -hmm. um, another day we'll, I would definitely want to do it talking about more spiritual stuff and emotional mm -hmm. things with oils. Okay. So that'll cool. be a good next class to do, right? Yeah. Yeah. So um, that's the exciting part about DDR Prime. And great question. Thank you. And um, okay, so that's the whole first 30 day program. You're going to feel completely different after, after this 30 days. The reason why I did it was in May was because I was really going downhill. You know, and when you need a lifeline or a reboot, mm -hmm. um, if you have all kinds of things wrong, you know, it's like this turned into that, and now I'm having digestive issues on top of, um, you know, feeling toxic, and I'm overweight, and then my mood is off, and my hormones feel weird. Like, this is a really great, boop, reset button, yeah. you know? It's like turning off your computer when it's acting weird, and just be like, okay, just sort yourself <laughs> out, right? So this is a way for you to sort up all the systems of the body and get out a lot of things that are gumming up the works. I mean, we're a perfect machine. We just need to create the environment for all the healing to happen. Mm -hmm. And this does that, right? So it's just like a clean sweep. Good. Now, we're going to go briefly into weight loss, right? And we're going to, we're going to, like I said, we're going to put these into, um, so that we can, you can look at all these pages. Yeah. Um, not my department, but, you know. Yeah. <laughs> uh, anyway, so when you do your detox, so once we've done our detox, now we want to, the, the last piece of the puzzle is to break into those fat cells, right? Mm -hmm. So your fat cells are also the, the dumping ground of toxins. Mm -hmm. When there's just too much toxicity or even, you know, too much food for you to handle, it takes your extra, you know, let's take, say you've taken a lot of meds or you, you know, you just live... A normal life, mm -hmm. you have more toxicity than your liver and your yeah. skin can process. It'll tuck it into a fat cell and then it'll bloop, it'll blow that fat cell up with fluid mm -hmm. and now your body's safe from that toxicity because it's yeah. floating inside that cell. It's stored in there. And there it is, right? And so <laughs> your rest of the body doesn't have to touch it, but it's making you fat. It's making you fat. Jiggly mm -hmm. and wiggly, right? So, and maybe like that stiff fat that's yeah. that's really bad too. Cottage cheesy, dimply, not smooth. Yeah, mm. not the sexy fat. We want the baby fat. We want sexy. new fat. New fat. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes I love to do slim and sexy. Just get rid of the old fat. Mm -hmm. I want fresh fat. Mm. Build it back with butter. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's that not butter. You guys that's know that. That's supple. You know, like like just seeing like supple yeah. fat. Oh, nice. so anyway, speaking of this, I used to have this terrible thing I called the yin curse. Um, <laughs> which was basically we'd get a little 
wing. Little wing that you could flap, right? So this is a lot better. Slim and Sassy. Slim and Sassy is an oil for it. Do you want to taste it? Yeah. Let's drink it. Let's taste it. Okay. That's I'll let y'all get okay. So Slim and Sassy is peppermint, ginger, uh, cinnamon, grapefruit, and lemon. And I could show you a little thing, but we didn't prepare for it, where it's like if you drop it onto a piece of styrofoam, in oh. five minutes the whole styrofoam dissolves, right? Um, because it's melting plastics. So the first thing, and the other thing about natural substances that um, the other things can't do, right? Even exercise, as you saw from my P90X videos, oh my god, I am right now salivating. I know, I feel like I'm salivating. <laughs> Did you put it in there already? I did, yeah. Cheers. 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 Chin chins. Chin chins. Chin chins. Chin chins. Mm. It smells so good. Is that nice? So, so again, like we take the Slim and Sassy as the shot, mm -hmm. and then you're going to also then do the big thing of lemon or grapefruit. Mm -hmm. Grapefruit's great on this case, especially if you have cellulite, right? Yeah. So tell people how you use Slim and Sassy. So Slim and Sassy, you drink it down the way that we just did. I like to do that morning and night. It comes know. in capsules. If yep. you're, if you're like that. It comes in capsules. You can also make your own veggie cap out of the mm -hmm. little blank ones. And you also rub it topically where you want fat loss. So whenever I was, I love to have abs, so I would always rub it from way like below my boobs because wherever you put it, it will take yes. the fat away. Do so not you put go, it on your boobs. Don't put it on your boobs. <laughs> Or your butt. You want to keep your butt, butt, too. You know, like, if you go anywhere, you just go up yeah, to here. And then you scoot butt, down, just... you know. Like. You want the butt <laughs> fat. Anywhere you put it topically, it helps stop your body from making new fat cells. And it encourages the shrinkage of the ones that you already have mm -hmm. while eliminating the fat Yeah, because it's going to pull, it's going to melt that toxicity that's in that fat cell. Okay, do mm -hmm. it. Do it. Okay, and then it goes. Right? And it goes out. And then look, you don't need all that fluid. That fat cell is going to shrink up. But it's also now an empty storage container. So if you have empty storage containers, you don't need to make more storage containers. So it's going to slow down the production of fat cells because they're ready. You know, they're like, yeah, just let me, let me, I'm ready. I'm empty. I can fill up again. And that's what happens. Like people will exercise really hard and they'll kind of shrink the, so the, here can be my toxin. So it'll shrink the fluid, so it'll be a little smaller, but that mm -hmm. toxin is still in there, mm -hmm. right? So then as soon as you stop exercise, you go, it just blows right back up again because it's doing it to protect your body. Mm -hmm. So this is different where it takes that toxin out of there and now you're free of it, right? Mm -hmm. And you're going like, okay, I've got all these containers that are ready because once you have all these fat cells, it's very hard to get rid of the cells themselves, right? Mm -hmm. But as long as they're flat and empty, it's fine. You can, yeah. have, you can have a bunch of them. And so topically, you can actually spot reduce. That's what I did. And I know what you're saying. No, you can't. Yes, you can. Uh, <laughs> you, yeah, you, you, yeah, you can, right? Uh, I'm, I'm, I need pictures of my family's uh, arms. Because, like, even I have a little bit. Like I said, I'm 47, right? Yeah. So mm -hmm. and if I need to, they, well, my arms are pretty good, right? So they weren't always like that, as you saw in my earlier um, pictures. <laughs> and that was me at, at like, 39, right? Mm -hmm. Really? So I've actually yeah. turned back the clock. And we can do that because of reducing inflammation, mm -hmm. getting rid of toxicity, and then supporting the skin to be supple again, right? Yeah. So wait, you used it for cellulite, right? The yeah, cellulite. I used it on my thighs. Ever, I mean, that's where most of my weight goes, is it goes to my thighs, my butt, and then it hits my stomach later. And I use it on my thighs, and I just internally, too, because it helps curb your appetite from craving more sweet things. Yes, the taste it does. Of it is like, yeah. it's spicy, it's minty, it's citrus. So you're getting all mm. these palatable flavors that really kind of steer you away from like, oh, I need that sugar. Yeah. You know, and you killed off all the guys that are craving the sugar. So now you're like, okay, now I really don't need that sugar. Yeah. Yeah. And Slim Sassy is super energizing. Yeah. Um, you drink it in the middle of the day. I remember we were driving from California deep into um, Sedona, Arizona, where I went to aromatherapy school. And there is nothing good to eat from like, I don't know, like from Fontana all the way six hours until you get to Sedona. There is nothing to eat, right? That's healthy. And I was like, I was starving. I was so hungry. I was like, what are we going to do? I'm not going to stop at that crazy kitchen where the truckers are. 
And so I just had Slim and Sassy. Of course, I had my oils with me. Mm -hmm. And I just put Slim and Sassy in my mouth and drank water, and my food cravings went away. Partly because then your body goes like, oh, I'll eat the fat. Yep. Right? I'll, I'll just digest the fat, and it'll start to pull on those fat cells and eat the fat that you already have. Because we got plenty of food living on our body. Mm -hmm. Lots you of know, it. There's lots and lots of food. And that's why I say if you eat a little less, take your supplements, and do the mm -hmm. cleanse, the, you'll start digesting. That's what has to happen. You have to digest pounds mm -hmm. and pounds of food and toxins that haven't left. Mm -hmm. Right? So that's the... Um, that's basically what it does. So we're going to go over Slim and Sassy. If you want to call us um, or email us, go to MalibuEO.com. You can choose Elaine as a mentor. You can choose me as a mentor. Myra is up there as a mentor. Did you see yourself up there as a mentor? No, I got it. Okay. All right. She doesn't know a lot about this yet, but after she does it, she's going to know a ton about this. But she does. She made soap. Yeah. And we don't she, she's our soap. soap artisan. She's our soap maker. So... Um, <laughs> So, you know, you can use Slim and Sassy uh, just about, I don't know, I maybe do, when I'm trying to lose weight, maybe I do eight drops a day. I would, I would, when I was on it pretty rigor rigorously, I would do two capsules, one in the morning, one at night, and I would do six drops in each one. So Whoa. So and then, and, and then. And topical at night. Yeah. So I was doing, so I was doing 18 drops total a day, but I mean. It, you know, there was this one them. woman, yeah, there was this one woman who I heard about who was quite overweight, and she got the wrong size capsule. The double, uh, like an inch big. Like yeah, and she around. was putting like 30 drops in, <laughs> and, and you know, we say rule of thumb, don't yeah. take more than 30 or 40 drops internally of oils a day. Um, <laughs> that's a lot, she was you know. going that's for it. A lot. Was she and okay? No, yeah. she lost, she was just, she was losing like so much weight that when we when they figured out like that's way too much she's like I don't care it's working fine so <laughs> you're gonna figure it out because yeah. when you're detoxing you are gonna feel those things so if it's pharmaceuticals if it's mm -hmm. meds you know like sometimes I joke around and say I can get high just by having some sassy and jumping up and down because um, <laughs> I've got some stuff stored up in myself um, shake it loose but, yeah <laughs> Get it a little jiggly. Oh, there it is. <laughs> uh, but it's, as you can see, it's a very happy oil. Mm -hmm. uh, when you do it topically, what you want to do is put a carrier oil on first. I like to do olive oil because it penetrates fat cells really easily. Mm -hmm. Then I put the Slim and Sassy, and then I get into a hot bath that's ready to go mm -hmm. because the oils are lipophilic, and they're repelled by water. Lipophilic means they love fat, basically. Mm -hmm. So they'll penetrate deeper into the fat cells and push away from the water. So mm -hmm. it really helps it penetrate when you do it that way. If you don't have a tub, do a warm washcloth and just stick it on yeah. top while you're watching TV and mm -hmm. just let it let it go in there. That feels good. It's like minty and spicy at the same well, time. It can burn. I mean, it can. It can burn, but then it's, it's just like, diluted a little bit more. Yeah, right? yeah that's it, all it you is. know, you really have to learn for yourself. Um, what dilution works for you, what, how many drops you need. I know Christina was doing like two drops a day and lost 12 pounds. Yeah, she lost a lot of weight just doing so little. She did a tiny bit and that worked for her. You know what I mean? So mm -hmm. you have to know yourself when you're using these oils. They're healing art. It's incredibly personal. Mm -hmm. So we can really only tell you what we've done and what we've seen. Um, we, you know, it, yeah. it, like sometimes that slim and sassy will burn. And to me, that's satisfaction because I know I had mm -hmm. toxicity. You know yeah. what I mean? So I like it, but the Asian ladies love the burn. Yeah. I mean, I did one Christmas. Uh, I brought it, and all my aunties and stuff had it on. They're like, oh, I burned. <laughs> so good. They were so satisfied. They all got it, right? So that will be the sev second month is what we recommend. Mm -hmm. Some people want to start, and today's little gift is a little bit of Slim and Sassy and Lemon um, because we do want you to see that they work and that, that you mm -hmm. do get results, but we definitely recommend that you start with the liver. Yeah. Start with the digestive system. Start with the cleanse, right? Because then your liver is going to be so mad at you. It's like dodging obstacles when you just want yeah. a clean path to run on. Yeah. And it might just like come out of your skin and, you know, yeah. make do all kinds of crazy stuff because it's 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 the real deal. Mm -hmm. It's gentle but powerful. Very potent. Yeah. Very very potent. So, okay. Um, if you want to join uh, doTERRA, you, your link is mydoterra.com slash oilsclub. And I and Earl are my 
doTERRA.com slash uh, Malibu. And Myra is mydoTERRA.com slash Playas. With an S. Um, <laughs> so like Playas. <laughs> yes. Playas. 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 Capitalizing on her life. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, so, okay, if you have any other questions, feel free to email us or mm -hmm. Facebook your questions and we will get back to you because we really want everybody to do this. Our goal is not to have to stay away from things, to avoid things because they're toxic mm -hmm. or, oh, I don't want to eat that because of the consequences. We want to be like rats. I want to be able to gnaw through duct tape and be like, ah, that's great. I can do it. You know what I mean? Like, I want to really feel like I'm undaunted by toxicity because I know how to detox my body because we can't avoid it, right? So I hope you'll join us on this journey and, um, yeah. Stay hydrated, my friends. Lots of water. Lots of water. Lots and lots of water. Because you're, you're going to pee and pee and pee and pee. You know, you, you're just going to, everything's going to come out. So yeah. you want to really hydrate that. that all. Okay, good. I like that. With, with the, <laughs> We got everybody drinking in here now. <laughs> All right. Bye, guys. Bye.